Hey everybody, Wade Vanderbilt here with DCTitleGuy.com and the Director of Sales and Marketing for Stewart Title, Northern Virginia, Washington, DC. And in today's video, I wanna to talk to you about the three signs that are indications that you need to switch your title company and relationship. And I realize sometimes change is hard because it's easy to stick with what you've always been doing. Having said that, just because you've always been doing something doesn't make it right, you know, or doesn't mean that it's best the best thing for you. So here are the three things. Number one, they are not talking to you about the CFPB changes that are happening in August 1st uh, and all the rule changes that are leading up to it. Uh, and if you're saying to yourself right now, hey, what's the CFPB? That's the sign, okay? Because your title company should have been talking to you about this, providing you the new forms, which I put on my website here, uh, you know, and talking to you about the three-day rule and more than that, all the other legalities are coming down with the CFPB, kind of who they're going after, what they're looking for, infractions, RESPA violations, all of these things that are coming down so that you know when August 1st comes or later and you have a settlement, you know what the forms look like, you know how to read them, you know how to explain them to your client, you know what could possibly push back a closing, and that your title company understands them as well. And if they haven't brought this information to you or been sitting down with you and explaining this to you, that's a sign you need to switch your title company relationship to somebody that is doing this stuff because it's greatly gonna impact your business and you need to know it. Number two, they're really good at taking your contracts, not very good at helping you build your business. Okay, so you know a lot of times you have eight, uh, title companies that will you know they'll take your contracts, thank you for the business. Maybe they'll do a, a good job, but they'll send you a thank you card, and that's kind of it. You know, maybe they'll sponsor a broker open, but what is the next level thing that they're helping you with? Are they helping you with a video marketing strategy? Are they helping you with an online marketing strategy? Are they teaching you how to get your content ranked? Are they giving you targeted farming data to market your subdivision or market to home buyers or sellers? Um, are they assisting you with other social media strategies or other savvy things that's gonna make you better that you can implement into your business that's gonna get more eyes to you, okay? So if they don't have someone that works for them that's helping you do these things, and all that they're doing is just the standard practice of taking a contract and closing it and saying thanks for the business, that's a sign you need to move on because business is a two-way street, okay? So my job is to help you grow your business, and in return, you send me business. So the more business you have, the more business we close, the more money you make, the more money we make, and everybody kind of grows at the same time, but we're giving back. It's not, hey, thanks for the business, and that's it, right? So if they're not helping you build your business, time to switch. Number three, they don't treat you like family or royalty. What I mean by that is if you walk into a real estate a title company office, someone that you've been sending consistent business to, and they don't even know your name, a girl at the front desk doesn't know your name, that's a problem, okay? Um, if they take your business for granted, um, that's a problem because I, I've, I've even found out in my own my own career that every time you take business for granted there's a good chance that you are losing it uh, so you always got to be on top of your game and these people uh, have to recognize you and make you feel loved because you are a big part of the reason why they're there right they need your business to continue with theirs um, so those are my three signs that you need to switch your title company relationship. If any of these are resonating with you and you are a Northern Virginia Washington DC real estate agent or mortgage lender Talk to me, okay? Because we're gonna help you with these things and hopefully you don't ever have to do any of this. So um, you can always fill out the form below and on, on here on my website, uh, dctitleguy.com, and tell me exactly how I can help you. You can call me at 480-203-6452. Always subscribe to my blog and YouTube channel uh, if you haven't already. So that way, whenever I post something that's relevant and helpful to you, you'll get an email in your inbox. That makes it really simple. You can always follow me on Twitter at DC Title Guy, and I look forward to working with you very soon.